Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In today's video, we'll be doing another Divine Masculine, Divine Feminine reading. If you do enjoy this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, and subscribe. Also, join membership if you'd like to. It is the join button below this video or the link in the description box. Um, I have not posted the extended stuff from the last reading yet. I still have to post that. It's just like, it was kind of like more of a negative message. So I'm like, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm getting there, guys. It's just, I hate posting that kind of stuff, so... Anyways, I think you guys will be much more happy with today's message. Um, it's very exciting. I get like really someone's very excited about something in this in this energy. And of course, I had to use this deck for this reading because I was like laughing again for some reason during this reading. And I'm like, okay, I don't know. This deck just was calling my name. So we had to bring it out. And I know now why it's, yeah. Anyways, okay, so also, as always, comment, like, and subscribe if you enjoy my content. I've already said that. Yes, join membership if you want to. Also, thank you so much once again to everyone who's bought decks off my Etsy shop. Um, all of the Simple Oracle ones are going out. I just am very dumb and accidentally got the wrong size of pouches for them. Um, I don't know how that happened. They're like almost perfect. They're just like a slightly too small. And I was like, I can't ship them in these. So very sorry about that. Anyways, they are going out all of them tomorrow. Um, and then yes, all the other decks, I've been shipping them just as they come in. So yeah, thank you so much to everyone who's ordered. And anyways, we'll get into this reading. Okay, so first off, someone is definitely on the move. Someone is definitely leaving another person because they are in love with you. Okay, like straight up, that is the message I'm getting. Someone could not forget about you for a long time. Um, you've always been on this person's mind and they're taking action on something. I'm seeing like very soon. I don't know why I keep getting this like antsy energy, like something's really just coming um, like very soon. I don't know. If you're in members too, and I told you my synchronicities like with my friends, um, you will understand also why I like freak out over this reading because uh they yeah the synchronicities are just wild for this month um that's all i will say but <sighs> anyways so i'm definitely getting something about travel um i was hearing something about an airport terminal things like that i keep seeing um like myself sitting in an airplane like looking out the window at clouds so that's definitely a message um also what i've been getting is something about yeah like train tracks a train um i'm hearing newport right now something about a station and i don't know why though okay i have to be honest when i get messages about the train i keep seeing the movie source code i'm seeing stuff about that song catch a grenade for ya jump in front of a train for ya and then i was hearing like abort get down get down something about a train and then what else happened with the train oh and then i keep i don't know if you guys remember i've channeled this in a few even like private readings too something about that whole spider-man scene i've been saying forever where he like stops the train from going off the tracks i don't know if this is like a metaphor but i keep getting this message and you know what's so strange is that in source code the man sounds like me talking <laughs> because he's like saying all these things that are about to happen like just before they happen and this girl's like how how do you know all of that? I almost get like a masculine, like meeting you being like, wait, how do you already knew? How did you know I was coming or something? I get something like that. But I also get like something about the fact that in that movie, it says that he thinks that he can stop the event before it actually happens rather than just finding out who the perpetrator is so they don't do it again. So I almost feel like this could have something to do with a court case. Maybe somehow, I don't know, this masculine or you play a role in a court case and like you help solve something or prevent something from happening. I don't really know guys, but this is just kind of what I'm getting or something to do with the train again, very significant. So that's coming out. And then also, sorry, Luca is now climbing. Ow, ow, ow. I have like bare legs right now. Ow, sorry, <laughs> that really hurt. Um, anyways, I'm getting a lot more than just that though. Like I see someone is like coming to visit you guys. Like I'm like quite literally getting that as in like on a trip, they're taking a trip to see you. I keep hearing stuff too about Italy, something about Florence, Italy traveling to italy i'm hearing canals right now um also was hearing something about bringing you your favorite chocolates something about they want to know what your favorite chocolates are or they're going to bring you them something about asking what kind of candy you like or what kind of snacks you like this person i'm hearing them like 1200 times be like hey do you want to see a movie on the weekend hey do you want to come see a movie with me almost like i'm seeing someone like practice in front of the mirror asking you i don't know why this is kind of like the energy i'm getting but like someone nervous and something about the movies like very strongly or they want to plan like a home movie night maybe something to do with harry potter because that just keeps coming out um 
yeah i'm hearing harry potter and the goblet of fire right now by the way i don't watch harry potter like people are probably gonna hate me for that i'm not a like i'm not a big harry potter fan not because i don't like it it's just like i never really watched them all um like i watched some of them for sure and i don't mind them at all so anyways but i'm just getting this message about movies snacks um this person's trying to get information on you like i'm also hearing something about they're following you on instagram or on facebook something about facebook's been coming out a lot lately like they're looking at your stuff they're trying to figure out or they were in the past trying to figure out if you were like with someone at all like i was hearing something like oh like i saw this picture of her like looked like she was in like a dark theater or something or she was in like um a jacuzzi i was hearing like but i couldn't tell if she was alone or like with someone almost like they're looking at your pictures trying to figure out like if there's someone else in it like have you ever had like a photo with another person like i see this person asking about that person and also um okay we'll just say this is where it gets interesting guys do you remember the one reading where i kept saying like if you want to be my lover gotta get with my friends like with this this card right here and of course this is why i felt i had to use this deck today because this is the message i was already getting even before using this deck but someone is talking to someone's friends okay if this doesn't happen yet like it will happen i'm seeing like they're your friends okay like they could be other friends too i don't know they could be other people you know or just someone who's like a mutual person you both have in common but i'm seeing guys this person is talking to someone about you um these people are in on something they're planning something together this is like an event that they're planning um and this person is asking these people by the way i see this person approaching these people nervously like maybe over social media or something um like reaching out to them and being like hey like i know you don't really know me that well or something and like i just want to apologize for the past like kind of like apologizing for for you because i see like maybe it, it's like that one last reading from a while back where this person wanted to be see like, seen in like a good light and your friend's eyes or something like they don't want to come across as someone who's toxic anymore they're kind of explaining how they've grown how they've changed to these people i see them trying to i'm hearing make sense of things um i'm trying to clarify with these people like what their intentions are because i see someone's friends being like defensive for them like like we saw in that other reading like someone like right well like what are your intentions with her like we need to know because we don't want our friend to get hurt like something like that or these are family members but someone's really protective over you they also know a lot about you it seems like um like i'm hearing someone be like oh no like she would have like that no no like i wouldn't do that something like that like they're giving this person advice i'm seeing stuff about um i'm hearing coffee cup right now that was coming through earlier this morning something about mid cafe like coffee um i'm hearing coffee mug anyways I'm seeing something about a coffee mug with a cat on it. Sorry, that was like super random. It could be black. Anyways, it could be a Christmas one. That's <laughs> so specific. Okay, I get something about the fact that they're asking what... I'm hearing what your favorite color is. Something about what songs you like. Um, that compilation of songs that I was hearing in other readings. List of your favorite songs. I see someone is making that for either an event that they're planning or because they're gonna take you on some sort of trip and they want songs to play in the car that you like like this person's thinking so much ahead um i'm quite literally getting this and then also they're asking about something else too oh they're asking this is so weird it's been coming through for two days barnes and noble is keeps coming out like something about books and it was so weird because my friends also were just talking about book club like i was just with my friends and i'm yeah you have to join members for like the one message account i'm just gonna say that there was like one message my friend said and i feel like it's so significant but anyways there was like so many synchronicities the night i hung out with my friends but um one of them was yeah they kept talking about books and then i'm getting in this reading this masculine asking something about a particular book that you like or like what types of book does she does she like do you think i can pick it up before i go there like i'm hearing someone wants to go pick up a very specific book or there's some sort of book i don't know that you guys talked about before i don't know why this is so important but i see something about even like a publisher maybe they want to publish their work your work i don't know but i get more so it's like they want to buy a particular book that they know you like or they remembered you maybe liked or they're asking your friends which books you read. I don't know what's with the book, guys, but it's really... I'm hearing it's very loud. It's coming out very loudly. I don't know what that means. 
but um, that's what I've been getting at. I keep hearing stuff about an author, publisher. I'm hearing Tom Clancy a lot. Um, just various things like that. I'm hearing Ronald Nolan right now. I don't even know if that's an author. Anyways, so that's coming through. But, like, quite literally, your friends are talking to this person. This person's, I'm seeing, like, making peace with your friends as well. Like, they're, like, taking them in, kind of, like, accepting this person. Like, I still see that they're kind of hesitant, too, in some ways. But I also see our friends are getting excited about something or some group of people is getting excited here because there's an event someone is planning, okay? Like, I see it could be outdoors. Something about even, like, a rooftop spot, I don't know how that works because like it's colder or maybe it's warmer where someone is but i see something about travel too and then also i keep hearing all these various places as in like i'm hearing like bali bali is that how you say it bali fiji i'm hearing new york again um something about and by the way arizona keeps coming up but i don't get that as like a vacation place like i'm hearing paris a lot a lot about france paris someone who speaks french um something about i'm hearing cayman islands right now i'm hearing something about what was the other australia sydney australia something about australia itself just has been consistently coming out brisbane um what's the other one italy italy definitely italy like i'm hearing about canals in italy florence italy i think i don't know did i already say that i've been saying it in so many other things i feel anyways so i'm getting those locations as in like i see someone who is by the way i'm hearing galapagos right now something about someone trying to figure out what location you would like even like they're almost like trying to figure out a place that they want to take you on a trip like i'm almost getting like people pitching in on some sort of trip or something about engagement like something about having a pinterest board like planning something that you don't even know about i don't know guys this is like so wild but this is what i'm getting very strongly i'm getting something about music and dance like they're planning the songs that you like I just keep seeing something about stuff you like. Like, they're getting a list of things you like. Um, even, like, I'm hearing flavors of things. Something about recipes. Um, dishes that you like. Uh, but, like, do you even see this card, guys? Like, look at the Knight of Cups. And we're talking about with your friends. Truth. Like, our friends know something. Someone here around you knows something. Maybe they're not telling you and they're not going to tell you. But I also see, like, there's something about an inside joke. Or they may have said something that was kind of, like... I don't know, I get like friends laughing because they know something that you don't know, something like that. But like, look at it. And then we have the marry me sign in this card and all the friends around. And it says boy bands. And I've been getting, I see someone playing guitar on the stage. And I see them like pulling you up on stage. I know this sounds crazy, but I'm also getting like Disney Channel, karaoke, high school musical songs. I know this sounds so wild, guys, but this is like literally so clear. Um... I am also getting the weirdest message ever that was just like, I don't know, almost made me emotional to get this message because, okay, there is a song I've been singing like my entire life and I'm just like, man, I think everything is so crazy right now because I just realized like, it's like I've been channeling my entire life basically because the fact that this song describes what I'm getting so clearly is just really weird. <laughs> so, and again, I didn't notice this song until now, right? Like, it didn't make sense till now. Like, I always say things don't make sense till they're supposed to. So, I'm going to read you it. You guys will probably know this song too, but my favorite singer when I was little was Avril Lavigne. So, it says, he was a boy, she was a girl. Can I make it any more obvious? He was a punk, which, by the way, have been getting something about that. Um, someone here could be, like, they wear beanies or they like to, like, rollerblade or they do skateboarding or something. Um, yeah, quite literally, skater boy. And then I was also hearing, or was, sorry, the rest of the song is, she did ballet, what more can I say? He wanted her, she'd never tell. Secretly, she wanted him as well, but all of her friends stuck up their nose. They had a problem with his baggy clothes. He was a skater boy, she said, see you later, boy. He wasn't good enough for her. She had a pretty face, but her head was up in space. She needed to come back down to earth. Says five years from now, she sits at home feeding the baby. She's all alone. Okay, what I'm seeing, guys, I keep seeing something's going to be on TV or if something makes it on the news, something about whatever this event is, or maybe it's just really popular. But I see this third party who could potentially have a child. I see them watching this happen on TV. I see them see this masculine on TV or they find out over social media that they did something like this for you. And I'm seeing it could have to do with the proposal as well, guys. Um, 
just keep this in mind as I read this. So it says, she sits at home feeding the baby, she's all alone. Turns on TV, guess who she sees? Skater boy rocking up MTV. She calls up her friends, they already know, and they've all got tickets to see a show. Says she tags along, stands in the crowd, looks up at the man that she turned down. <laughs> and I also get like, your friends already know about this or something, or they're part of this. Like, I'm hearing something about they're learning dan a dance, like a choreographed dance or something. Like, they're all going to participate. I don't know what's with the megaphones. Like, I keep seeing people holding them and something about signs, like picketing. I don't know. But, like, they're holding a sign in this card, too. So, maybe it's, like, part of a thing. I don't know. Okay. But I get, like, someone almost, like, annoyed at this event. Like, this third party could show up even at the event, too. I'm not really sure. Um, you know, try and, like, get in the way somehow. Or, like, I was hearing something about pushing someone off a stage. Like, someone was, like, so mad. So, I have no idea. Maybe someone loses it at this point. But, like, honestly, just, I don't even want to focus on that energy right now. So, anyways, in the rest of that song, it says, you know, he was a skater boy. She said, see you later, boy. He wasn't good enough. He wasn't good enough for her. Now he's a superstar slamming on his guitar, which I keep getting stuff about guitar. Does your pretty face see what he's worth? By the way, I keep getting something about speak easy bars and like this person could have played or practiced an instrument like without even knowing or like without anyone really knowing. I get like almost a secret talent that they don't want to show until it's ready kind of thing. Like it's very special almost. Um, even learning a dance or something. Uh, okay, anyways. And then in that song, it says... Sorry, girl, but you missed out. Well, tough luck, that boy's mine now. We are more than just good friends. This is how the story ends. Too bad that you couldn't see. See the man that boy could be. There is more than meets the eye. I see the soul that is inside. Yeah. Okay, and we're talking about souls, soulmates, twin flames, right? And also the fact that we're saying we are more than just good friends and I get this masculine to get away from this person. I'm hearing something like he definitely had to lie. He may have said that he's sick or something. I keep getting that weird message. Something about the fact that you guys are just friends, that you're going to be business associates. I keep saying something about an interview still, but like there's so much more to that. I even see you getting invited somewhere, like not knowing fully what it's for. Um, I see someone even buying you an outfit for this. Like I'm hearing something about purple dress, purple something. Um, as in like, I think that color came through in older readings too. It's odd. It's like coming through again now. Purple headdress even I was hearing. Just like, I don't know. By the way, I'm seeing the magic carpet right now for some reason, like Aladdin on the magic carpet, but it's like purple. I don't know why that is a message, but it's very interesting. So that could definitely be something here. Um, I'm hearing Hartman right now too. Something Hartman, Molly Hartman, Mr. Hartman. I don't know why I'm hearing that. I'm like seeing it too. Um, anyways, and it says, he's just a boy. I'm just a girl. Can I make it any more obvious? We are in love. Haven't you heard how we rock each other's world? And guys, I, I like see this going viral or something like I see you guys being in the spotlight somehow like this event I'm hearing it's going to take the world by storm I don't know where that came from but I'm hearing that or something about it's going to be storming that day I keep seeing something about the moon is significant like something about it's a half moon or a sliver moon I was hearing something about someone reminds someone of sailor moon even or maybe because like they feel you're very spiritual or you have like these I mean, abilities or just like something about you to this person reminds them of that i just kept hearing something about sailor moon maybe they like comics and things like anime and stuff i don't know um i don't know much about anime to be honest but i was getting stuff about like the last airbender before is that anime i'm not sure um but guys like Oh, this person is like on their way. Also, uh, what else was I getting? There's like this other message too I wanted to say. Can I remember it? Um, oh my gosh, I don't know. Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, I'm getting something about Wolverine, but like I figured out I think why I was hearing it. Um, I don't know. If someone's like, okay, I think someone's fantasizing, or maybe this happened in the past, but I'm seeing something about, like, scratch marks on someone's back, as in, like, Wolverine, it looks like the the marks from his claws or something, we'll just say, but I get it in more sexual energy. Also, this person 100%, like, was asking other people how to approach you as well, and I see something about them, um, trying to give them advice and something about this person wanting to just like kind of show up unannounced i'm hearing something about okay i was hearing same day delivery and then i was channeling a specific like 
box cardboard box company like shipping box corrugated boxes which i've channeled forever that's made in like washington or something and i see them like wanting to deliver something themselves even and i see a letter like i very 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 strongly get a handwritten letter is so significant or a postcard of some sort but i see they're they're writing something they're most definitely writing something and um they also have a gift with it like i said by the way, I've been hearing stuff about Cheddar Block. I don't know, again, the stinking cheese message. It's funny I said stinking because I've also been channeling lactose intolerance, so who knows. But something about fondue. I was hearing something about fondue tower and how someone, like, thinks that... I don't know. There, I was, like, hearing, I've already seen that one. Like, I don't like that one or something. I don't really know. Um... I don't know. Maybe someone's, like, planning it for the event or something like that. I'm hearing brownies right now, too. But, um, okay, where was I at there with the door thing? Yeah, I see someone at your door. I almost see someone, like, driving around, like, they aren't ready to, like, go to your door yet. So they kind of, I see you pacing back and forth outside someone's door. Like, just not going for it. I keep seeing them also tell your friends or tell some other person, like, I don't know if I can do this. I don't know, man, like, I'm so nervous. But, um, yeah, they're really nervous. I keep hearing they're, like, sweating a lot, too. Um, and then I have to be honest. <laughs> This is so cute. I see it's like emotional when you guys like come back together and this person's going to give you their letter and their gift. And then I see you guys hug and then it's like, I don't know what this is. It's like this person is like, there's something about covering their eyes. Like they need to cover their eyes or something. I get this like sexual energy as in like, okay, this person might have a boner. Um, when they hug you, hopefully you could hear that. And they don't want you to know and they like pull back. And I almost feel like they tell you though. They're like, oh my god, I'm sorry. <laughs> like they're so embarrassed or they're trying to hold back and they're like, come on, don't do that to me right now. Like they see someone annoyed with themselves. They find you so attractive and they're just like so excited to see you. Okay, not just like in that way. Like they're quite literally just so happy. Like I just get the most excited, happy energy. Almost like a little puppy or something. This person also could have a puppy. Like, maybe they just got a new dog. I was hearing something about a lab or border collie. I don't know. I was hearing some other dog name, too. A schmoodle. Sh I don't know. I was hearing schmoodle. Um, sh like, a mixture of shih tzu and poodle. Not really sure. But, uh, yeah. I, I, and I was hearing a dog barking as I was talking about this, like, earlier. Or when I was, like, reading on this part earlier. So, I thought that was kind of interesting. Something about that could be important. I almost feel like, yeah, you're not, like, fully expecting this person or not fully ready. I also see them, like, giving you... I was hearing Saint Laurent. Is that... I don't know if that's perfume or something, but I do get stuff about cologne or perfume. I'm hearing stuff about makeup, even. Like, NARS something. Uh, Fenty. I'm hearing, like, really nice stuff. I see someone, like, wanting to spend a lot on you. Like, I'm hearing spoiled, but I also keep hearing something about someone's gonna spoil it or someone wants to, like, spoil it for this person. Like, almost like maybe one of your friends is not very good at keeping secrets. Like, someone wants to tell that this person is back in town, I'm hearing. I'm even hearing, like, don't tell that I'm back or something or it's a secret that I'm here. Like, I don't want her to know yet. Something like that because they want to come in at a very particular time. I keep hearing something about Friday and Saturday. Like, the weekend, obviously, that's a very normal time. But I'm seeing something about asking you to go to a movie or have a movie night in at your place. Um, and I still get this message of them wanting to, like, live with you, but also, like, support you. Um, like, if they moved out of a situation, like, they might not be able to go back to this place. Because I see something, again, like, dangerous happening or, like court case that went on i don't know if this is related to your situation but this has been coming through for a while now i still am getting that um if anyone's involved in a court case like this like i see with the whole situation that we talked about previously that was really awful i have to be honest i do see something about like death guys and i'm hearing like justice for someone here like you know when people protest and like justice for whoever like i'm seeing that like as in like a mother even like being devastated like i'm seeing a family but then you know what's weird is i get this like mafia i'm hearing mafia right now like energy of like a gang energy or like a group of people something about co-workers like this was like a with a co-worker or something within a business like a family business but i see like even a family member could have done something i'm hearing something about someone's cousin or someone's father or aunt like something i don't know what's with someone's aunt that keeps coming through too but i see like something about um someone's going to receive a very um 
large amount of money for whatever this is like you're going to be heavily compensated is what i was hearing like they'll receive a large check and something about you know getting at least having some peace for this person like that knowing that this other person's gonna go to jail for a long time i'm hearing something about um maybe not with the option of parole um i see this person again could have been in and out of jail already um, I also see this person, like, really emotional, like, the other person, like, again, trying to get people to, like, feel bad for them in some way, I don't know, by the way, oh, I also wanted to point out, I had a vision earlier, I had a few visions that are very random, um, one of them was, like, someone had a bandage on their wrist, it almost looked like there was, like, a bluish mark blackish mark kind of like coming through like almost like they just got a new either a new tattoo or something about like i don't know maybe it was an injury like to the wrist like we were talking about i have to be honest as well again another trigger warning um i do see something about unaliving oneself um maybe because of ptsd maybe because of trauma um that they've experienced or because they feel like again something about their sibling is always the one getting all the attention like i see something about the bathtub again guys um something about a pool um very strange messages i see a lot about water lately again you know how we saw in the past readings about a boat water underwater i was like okay i've had numerous dreams lately and visions of myself swimming underwater like i naturally love being underwater i know this sounds super weird i have like a weird talent for swimming underwater i can hold my breath for like a super long time it was just like something i was like gifted with i want to say so i find it very peaceful so when i had these visions i was like oh like i, I love this <laughs> um this is something like you know i don't know why i just like i felt very at peace with that but then i also get this like more deeper that's weird i use the word deeper message because that song was coming through today too like um by valerie something or i don't know something starts with a v it's like deeper 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 i don't know it's like the title but anyways um i keep getting these visions of swimming underwater like in an ocean um just like or in a pool could be a pool as well it's just a body of water i was hearing something about someone naked in a pool something happening in a pool or someone sinking something about a boat i keep hearing a boat sinking off the coast of somewhere something about a cruise ship too but i don't know if the cruise ship is related i've been hearing something about a cruise ship for a very long time or a cruise region i keep hearing which i think is like a cruise line um i was hearing highliner silver lining something about um transatlantic um something about pacific ocean uh so i'm gonna be i'm hearing maritimes right now that's very random but yeah, something about a cruise um, could be important here. Like right now I'm seeing like the window of a boat, like water sloshing against it. Um, so I, I don't know what that's about, but I keep getting these visions. And it's like always a girl. It's almost like I'm seeing it from an outside perspective even. Like I see a girl swimming underwater. Like I have to be honest, like it looks like a girl. They have long hair. They like just kind of floating there. And I don't know, guys. Keep seeing this over and over. And then the splish splash I was taking a bath song keeps coming out. So... I don't know it could be a nice message could be a not so great message i just keep seeing stuff about the water something happening in the water or that could be even what a court case is based on um you know if something was serious or not but i was also hearing something about okay these are just like some odd messages coming through i want to just tell you guys about there's also something coming through about someone i was hearing someone trying to get into someone's house and then they were like naked i don't know why they're naked and then they like fall into the pool uh, I don't know, I was hearing that, and there's something about, like, they're hiding between the bushes or something, trying not to be seen, and then I was hearing pe almost, like, two people talking, they're, like, um, saying that the door's wedged shut or something, or the door's stuck, they can't get the door open, I was hearing, uh, something about a sliding door, sliding glass door, too, and then I was hearing, like, try the other door, um, I don't know, someone's trying to break in, guys, because constantly I've been getting advertisements, too, for, like, door, um, keypads and then my door keypad that i actually have ran out of batteries too and my dad was like you need to replace that right away and like freaked out about it so i really feel like that could be a message which by the way it's all replaced now we're good um yeah i'm big on like having security and everything so um i don't know that's just like a strange message and i keep seeing someone try and um do something like try and get in with a key or they have a key 
something about that that came through a million times in like older readings too but um definitely something going on with that like i don't know the message about the door was weird it was just like they couldn't get the door open so they were trying the other one and i was getting something about like i don't know i've seen like my my grandparents farm which is like so random so maybe it's like somewhere in the middle of the country or something or maybe people don't normally lock their doors or something very like woodshed i'm not sure i'm also hearing something about a caravan i'm hearing something about catching someone in a parking lot like doing stuff as well something about something happening in a car uh arrested i keep hearing warrant for your arrest uh something with police again i feel like this i don't know what this situation is just like coming out in this reading oh geez but like someone's even like third party uh person could be involved like i'm seeing someone who had a child something about the child even um custody of a child or who the father of a child even is it could even be something about like I forget if I mentioned this in the last reading, but again, like, trigger warning. I don't know. These readings are getting weird. Something about, like, incest. Like, it could have been, like, something in the, like, two people in the family. Like, but not in, like, one person wasn't, you know, wanting this to happen. Or, I don't know. I get something about doing something for money or doing something for a contract or a deal um, in relation to business. Like, it has to do with getting financing for a business because I told you guys in the last reading something about pulling fund in, funding on a business. Um, so, I don't know. And I see, like, a mask and it could have gotten wrapped up in, like, someone's family business and then, like, gotten out of it. I even say, like, maybe he's going to be estranged from some of his family now. Like, maybe. I get, like, something about your friends or family, like, being, like, this person's new group of people or something. Like, maybe they don't have, like, as many people as they can rely on as they thought. Something like that. Like, the people closest to them, you know, just ended up kind of hurting them or something. Yeah, I don't know. I just, I get this type of energy here. I definitely see someone extremely jealous of you, by the way. Um, okay, if you message this masculine while he was with this other person, I see them finding out and getting extremely mad. Uh, something about following you or something on Instagram or like uh, having you as a friend or something on online. And this person being like, that's not appropriate in a relationship and telling this person to block you. So I do see for some of you, this masculine did block you because of another person telling them to. Um, and then if they did do that, uh, I see a masculine getting, like, very sad, actually, that they couldn't say anything else to you. Like, they they kind of knew that they shouldn't be doing that in a relationship. But, like, also at the same time, like, maybe you guys were talking about nothing that's, like, inappropriate, really. Maybe you just said, like, the odd message or something. I don't know. Or you just liked their photos sometimes. Something like that. But I see that um, they were, like, really sad when that happened. They kind of realized, like, how much they did need you like or like talking to you or something i don't know i just see someone they felt like this person was really annoying them which i mean if you're in a relationship i kind of understand that like not talking to other people outside of it makes sense but um i see this person maybe like being really extreme about it and like constantly checking his phone or something or being like who are you following now like i need to see your follower list like something like that like being very controlling about it a little bit um like always in his ear i'm hearing i just keep getting this like parrot energy like someone just like kind of annoying in someone's ear all the time that's that's kind of what i feel like he felt like in this connection and by the way once again i still get this like kind of nerdy energy i also keep seeing this masculine showing up in like a suit or like looking like james bond or something <laughs> i don't know what's with that like he's wearing sunglasses wearing like a nice suit or tux or something <laughs> i don't know why he's dressed like this but then i also see him like more um, like casual or something like that's not maybe normally how he dresses um i also keep hearing something about like did you dye your hair orange or something i keep hearing like red or someone likes that color something about a haircut's been coming through or like they get a haircut just before they come see you um yeah i don't know this is so odd <laughs> but this is what i'm getting there's like definitely an event coming up there's definitely something about proposal um, I'm just gonna see if I wrote more stuff down. I also heard hearing Mary Magdalene. Magdalene? I don't even know if I'm saying that right this morning. I've never said that in my life. Like, I don't think I've ever said that before. So, that was, like, super random. I channeled that. I had to look up even what it meant. I still don't really know. I didn't really read the definition. I actually don't think I did. So, I might have to look that up. I think it has to do with, like, a, um, a saint or something. I'm hearing the saints come marching in. Also, I was getting something today about Stuart Little, um, the mouse movie. Something about Disney Channel is really coming through. Something about an ice skating rink. Um, 
Disney on Ice, something about that. Um, Walker Field, I was hearing. I don't know what that is either. I was hearing Walker Field, something about plants, something about cookies. I was hearing the Cookie Monster, something about crumble, crumbling. I think that's a cookie company. So uh, someone could bring you cookies or bake you cookies is what I keep getting. I've heard Toll House a lot of other readings. Um, okay. Uh, where else did I write stuff here? Also the number seven, guys. Oh my gosh. The number seven is coming through constantly. And I keep hearing like seven days, seven nights, seven days, seven nights. Do you want to go on a trip like this long? <laughs> something like that. Like a road trip. Something about camping under the stars keeps coming out. Like, someone's going to take you somewhere, I see. Also, I was seeing something about, like, hey, I just need to, like, fix myself up a little bit before we go. <laughs> like, something about someone feels rushed, like they're doing their makeup in the car or something. I don't know. I don't know what I'm getting. And then, yeah, I was hearing something about a boat sinking off the coast of somewhere. Something about Atlantis keeps coming out. If you guys remember my past readings, um, so about Atlantis or finding something underwater. That was actually one of my, like, world prediction messages, I think. Um, which is strange because then I also named my cat Kita after Kita from Atlantis and then now Atlantis is coming back out again in the readings and I even saw like a random video about it recently like talking about the fact that it could be in a different location blah 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 so I don't know maybe there's something going on with like underwater underwater caves even um I don't know if I mentioned this yet in these readings I think I definitely did in members but I really strongly get something about finding oil underground or something about oil rigs out in the ocean is very significant or something about just oil in general or finding something valuable underground in a new location or there's something going on with mining for something like as in mining for gold i know that sounds super random but uh this has actually come through for a long time i just haven't really talked about it so if you guys go back though to one of my older readings there's one video where i talk about just like underground tunnels and I thought I was losing my mind I was like am I just talking about subway stations or something but then I think the front cover like the thumbnail of that video is like a mining thing like something about mining and I swear I'm getting something about a discovery something about gold I also keep hearing Egypt something about Nile River um and then also so random I was getting visions for the last like maybe week about like water rushing I just kept hearing water all of a sudden rushing in like a dry like an area where basically like in my vision it was always like where there was no water and where like there was a dam built or a wall or something and then all of a sudden there's just like this rush of water like all the water just flows out and I just assume it just has to do with like you know someone's emotion pouring out but I also get it like maybe more literally and then it was so weird there was a new video talking about how um a place in the middle of the desert I forget where it is all of a sudden this river started flowing that hasn't flowed in like years the water just came out of nowhere and um it was like written in the bible it was like Isaiah something and I've been channeling Isaiah forever and I was like that is so weird it looked like my vision so I don't know guys I was wild so that's coming through and then the mining stuff okay I'm seeing quite literally like chunks of gold like something about maybe mining for something is going to make someone very wealthy or maybe there's something going on with this. I keep hearing like it's all connected, like something with like a big group of people, like a, a gang or something. Or like maybe this is bigger than we think it is, this whole thing. I don't know because that kind of came through in past readings. Um, or maybe it's just like a whole family thing going on. Something about the industry, something about agriculture even. But I just keep seeing something underground that is like worth a lot or something i just keep seeing that and then i was also okay this is where i got weird i think i talked about this in members but i was also seeing stuff about like finding a new planet and something about okay i know this sounds crazy but like i'm seeing something about finding like things like elements on another planet or like something that's valuable something about that like in our solar system almost, almost like just like a random person finds this planet like not even like nasa or something or just like a novel what is it called like a novelist person or someone who's like more new to you know space and like research and astronomy something like that i'm not sure i was just getting these strange messages about other planets and it got way even deeper than that but i like i don't want to go too far into the topic but there's definitely stuff going on with like natural resources something about oil or gas and something about 
gold, like super strong, getting messages about, I, like I was seeing the pick, like the thing that they use for mining. And then I was seeing like stuff about drills and then like, yeah, again, the oil rigs in the middle of the ocean. I just keep seeing that something about that is really relevant and it would make sense to some of my other visions as well. So I don't know, just wanted to point that out for some reason that could be relating in the future that might be more of like a larger scale thing like maybe news story or something that goes on with like environmentalism i'm not sure i keep hearing al gore does that have to do with i can't remember who that is is that like um someone who has to do with environmentalism and stuff like that as well like global warming or something i'm not really sure um i i sorry guys i don't pay a lot of attention to like news or anything about that stuff i try and like i stay in my own bubble <laughs> like, i have to be honest um yeah, mostly just for like my own, you know, positivity and things. I try and focus on what I can do, not like just all the stuff going on in the news. But anyways, not sure where I'm going with this. Um, That was like super random. We'll just pull like a few more cards, see if there's anything else that comes out. Maybe we'll do like some of the, uh, what are they called? Letters again, like the pull some letters again, some words, you know, I feel like you guys liked that last time. <laughs> I like doing that. It's something different. So Maybe we'll just do that quickly at the end and then, yeah, we'll call it a day. By the way, something about spices or spice jars could be relevant. Sorry, I just keep staring at that word spice. And I was looking at my spice jars just the other day too. Um, something about, uh, what was it? Um, here's sea salt, but like pink Himalayan salt. I kept staring at that, something about different salt. Um, even Epsom salt bath, something about, by the way, oh yeah, that was the other message. Um, someone wants to give you like a spa day. I just keep hearing that. Um, we talked about that already, but I keep seeing someone wants to like provide you a spa day, something about even getting your nails done, your hair, like pampering, spoiling. I don't know. That's just what I keep hearing. Something about like, if you worked really hard, someone feels like you deserve that. Yeah. I don't know. Whoever this person is, like they want to do the most for you is all I keep getting. And they're, like, thinking up things. Like, this looks like a mad scientist in the lab. They're like, okay, what else can I do for her? Like, how can I make this the best day possible? Like, they're planning. They're a big planner is what I get. They really want this. I'm hearing they want it to go off without a hitch is what I'm hearing. I also kept seeing the Mater, Mater car the other day, too, by the way. Um, you know that one from, I'm hearing Toy Story right now, but from Cars, that movie. And that's come through before. Yeah, definitely something going on with like a judge too or like a court situation. That just keeps coming out. <sighs> I'm hearing padlock on the door. I don't know, maybe someone's like nervous about something. They need to really lock things up. Lock it down, I'm hearing. Someone needs to lock it down before it's too late. All right. Also, wow. Okay, this looks just like what I was seeing with the boat with someone looking out the side of the window of the boat. Look, that's just what I was seeing. That's really interesting. Hmm. I something about the boots again or shoes. I keep getting something about shoes, hiking boots, like hiking somewhere up a mountain. Also, okay, what is this song I keep hearing? I wish you could even sing it. There's like no words. It's like, it's on Instagram. It's like on Reels. Like, it might be the Interstellar song. I think that could be where it's from, but it like keeps replaying in my head over and over and over and over and over like i'm so tired of hearing it um maybe i'll take a watch that movie it's a really good movie uh i really think it relates to a lot of stuff we talk about here so yeah a lot of higher meanings i love movies like that anything related to that so anyways um yeah oh my god look i swear someone's telling your friends something look like this is someone who's been really cold who like your friends are like wait he's reaching what <laughs> like i feel like your friends don't even understand why this person's suddenly just asking about you to them like or they're just like wait you want to know about her like i thought you guys like weren't talking anymore you were like moved on with someone else or something like these people don't even know and they're like wait what like i feel like your friends know something this is coming from someone who like doesn't say a lot by the way i also saw them like telling other people about to like an incident that went on or like explaining some sort of like almost like abusive situation or like explaining why they couldn't reach out i even see something about someone saying that they were in prison or like they um, were wrongfully like in prison for like a short period of time or they were like kind of trapped somewhere because they had to be a part of some sort of court case or something like not necessarily they were like the prime suspect or anything they were just like involved in it so they couldn't leave 
like something like that as well I see or they were just dealing with if it wasn't that um just like a legal matter in terms of like divorce uh something along those lines I'm hearing something about crappy weather today yeah someone's worried about the weather for whenever this event is I'm hearing Christmas time I'm hearing Craigslist that keeps coming through yeah I feel like your friends are like Something about, like, uh, talking about childhood things. That would make sense, the fact that I'm talking about the Avril Lavigne song. Um, I keep hearing the Hilary Duff song, too, Let the Rain Fall Down. I swear it's going to be raining when you guys reunite something about umbrellas. But I get this, too, as, like, making a list of things you like, like, planning things, planning what you're they're going to bring, something like that. Like, I'm hearing about a picnic. Something about the number of people coming. Um, like, I see someone making plans. I'm hearing plastic cups, plastic bottles, cutlery. By the way, oh, I also see someone showing up at your door with um, a f like flowers. Like I see roses specifically, like very strongly. See? Oh my God, see? Oh guys, this is so legit. Look, this is hidden. This is something that you don't really know about. Well, clearly you might. It says I know what you did, but, <laughs> but look at There's friends involved and look, they're talking about a movie. Like, he's like, do you think a movie is a good idea? Like, should I take her to a movie? I swear, someone wants to ask you to a movie or something about having, like, a movie night in. Like, they're going to set it up and make it look really cute or something. Like, that's just what I keep seeing. Someone's being cautious about uh, reapproaching as well. Um, something about because they had red flags before. Your friends are, like, maybe cautious about this person with you. Like, they want what's best for you. But I feel like they see this person has genuine intentions, what I'm hearing. Again, I'm hearing something about crab legs and we have this part of your world card again. Um, see, I swear. Okay, I've been feeling this energy. Like someone is like right there. Like they're so close to you. They're like so, so close to you, I feel. I just have got this energy, guys. And you know why? It's like, okay, like I'm having dreams about like someone I used to know. And... That makes me think of that song, like, Somebody that I used to know, you didn't have to cut me up. Yeah, um, I'm having dreams about someone too. Like, I have not thought about this person. Like, literally, they have not been in my dreams, like, ever since I, like, knew them or, like, was around them. Like, I haven't seen them in forever. And they randomly were in my, like, last two dreams. And they were just there. And you know what's so weird? Both dreams are, like, super similar. And, um... In one dream, there was like a third party person and she was like in the middle and she was like annoyed that I was talking to them, to him. And then um, both dreams were at a mall, like a shopping mall. And we we're like outside of like a food place, something about that. And then like both times he like didn't really say anything. He just like looked at me and then would just like walk away. And then I wouldn't see him again or they'd be like, oh, like he went to go get something or like, I don't know, it was so weird. Like, he was just there, and we would just stare at each other, and, like, my friends were always there, too. Like, for some reason, my friends were there in every dream as well, and it was always in, like, a social setting, like, literally at the mall. So, I don't know if that's a message for anyone, but, like, that is just something that I've been finding really strange. I really get this strong feeling, like, someone is closer. I just keep hearing that. Like, they're closer than they've been. I'm hearing approaching. Yeah, I'm hearing approaching you. Oh, my God, what? It was so random. There's this random card in this deck that is not from this deck, but wow, guys. Anyone, Virgo? Um, both of these are the Hermit card, and that just happened to be the only card that was in this deck from another deck. So uh, definitely a message there. Something about being very insightful to going inwards. Someone is really, I'm hearing, learn their lesson as well. Like if they need to learn something, like I feel like they've gone through what they needed to go through, kind of like... You know they've completed the cycle like they've leveled up in some way and they feel like finally they're ready to like return you know like it's it's time i'm hearing i keep hearing it's time yeah three of swords this came through earlier too heartbreak talking about the past someone walked away but i feel like it's not really over we have the hangman yeah it was like you guys were almost on pause i'm hearing like from friends we were on a break <laughs> something about being on a break um this is where it gets weird again do you do you see what i mean about the train thing like i said spider-man and the train and look what cards come out and this is like boom and we have spider-man so i don't know i just found that really strange construction i'm hearing something about it says never give up on this card oh my god guys i can't the synchronicity is 
Ugh, I was, this morning, decided to randomly play uh, TNT. Look what this says. This is TNT Dynamite. And this morning, I was just, like, really wanting to listen to some ACDC <laughs> to hype me up. So I was listening to that song, and I kept being like, I wonder if TNT is important. Literally, this card comes out. Like, I, I can't. That makes me think of, too, like, again, maybe something underground. Like, as I also was getting um, cards coming out about Explosion. It's something with a train, though. And, like, a hero, someone helping. I don't know what this is. Why do I keep getting these messages? This is Bam and Boom. What is with this explosion? Can you tell me about that? What is with this? Not gonna lie, this could also be a sexual thing as well. <laughs> Someone's ready to explode. Yeah. Um, it very well might be that. I'm, I'm just gonna say. Because I get that. Like, when this person sees you again in person, their mind is like, they can't deal. I'm really getting that energy. Like, this person is like, going nuts. Like, oh wow, of course that's the word I choose. Like, they just, they can't. They can't deal with it. By the way, I was hearing someone could wear a gold chain necklace, like solid gold chain, something about that. I'm hearing Jafar right now, something about Aladdin. That's been coming through too. I kept hearing that song like for months now. I've been hearing another Arabian night. And you know what's weird is that because it's now like a TikTok song, like people everywhere are singing it. And when I first channeled it, it was not popular. Like it wasn't out anywhere. Like people weren't singing it. And then all of a sudden everyone started singing it. So I don't know, again, weird. I'm not gonna say I started that trend, but you know. <laughs> <laughs> and then, okay, I also channeled Olsen Twins. So this is very strange. Something about twins, maybe? Oh, so weird, guys. Okay, maybe we have twins in the future, someone here. My family always used to tell me growing up, they would be like, oh yeah, like we think you're gonna have twins when you're older because apparently, I don't know, I don't know if this is just a myth or something. They said it skips a generation sometimes, so like everyone assumed like I would, but I never really had an interest in having kids to be honest, guys, but. I don't know, like, I, I haven't written it off or anything, but it's just, like, not something I've ever really thought about, but, yeah, I, oh, you know what I get, actually, with this card, is more stuff about childhood memories, like, I don't know if you have a really close friend that you grew up with, like, all this stuff about Avril Lavigne and different songs I was getting, it reminds me of stuff we would sing when I was little, like, this is talking about, and then the Game Boy, this movie, this is talking about someone's childhood or something. If someone's looking at um, old photos of you or they're showing someone photos of you when you were younger is what I'm hearing. Maybe you have like a best friend, like you guys are in photos together. Like maybe you kind of look alike when you're little or maybe you do have a twin. Um, I really get that very strongly. Something about someone's looking at your childhood photos or talking to your friends about you when you were younger and they're like describing things you guys used to do when you were little. Yeah. I 100% get that. Um, also, like, yeah, someone's trying to gather information. And then also Paris again is coming out. I keep seeing the Eiffel Tower everywhere. That's been coming through for, like, a bazillion years. But, wow, that is such a message. It's about childhood, guys. Like, someone is... They could be looking at scrapbook pictures. This came through in another reading. I'm going to bungee jumping. Also... Sorry, I'm hearing bookworm as well. Someone could be a cancer. I'm hearing, yeah, I'm hearing club penguin. Like, I don't know, someone played that. Clarissa explains it all. The high priestess. Hmm. Mm hmm. This is looking to me, I don't know why this right here was reminding me of like a postcard or like some sort of like invitation or something to a party. But yeah, this is like, I feel like you know things are going on. Someone knows here intuitively, like someone's talking about them. Like I feel like you wouldn't have no clue that this is going on. Like you'd be feeling something. <laughs> oh my God, literally. This is someone talking about their childhood. I was channeling Beanie Babies the other day and I was like, why do I keep channeling this? This is so random. Someone's talking about growing up like they're telling them about you like someone wants to know more about you too like if this is in the future like someone's gonna ask so many questions about you 
Wow. Look at the card on top. The Empress. We have the Empress, the High Priestess. And what was that? The Five of Pentacles, which honestly is just, I think it's coming out because of the Beanie Babies. But yeah, someone wants to know about you. I guess what I'm getting. Um, the other thing too, I found really weird. The other song that keeps coming through is the, um, <laughs> Demi Lovato song where it's like, this is real, this is me, I'm exactly where I'm supposed to be now, gonna let the light shine on me, cause now I found who I am, there's no way to hold it in, no more hiding who I wanna be, this is me, yeah, and it says, you're the voice I hear inside my head. The reason that I'm singing, I need to find you. I got to find you. Yeah, I get this like very telepathic connection. And other weirdest thing ever is that that song is also very significant to my childhood. Not only because of the song itself, but because, guys, I think maybe I was meant to channel. I just didn't know it because I literally wrote the chorus to that song. Like, I'm not saying I wrote that song, but like I wrote the chorus to it before it ever came out. Like I have it. I don't know if I still have it in my memory box, but like I literally wrote the entire chorus to that song and then she made that song. And I was like trying to go around and tell everybody. I was like, I swear I already wrote it. And they were all like, yeah, right. Like I'm sure you copied it. I was like, no, I swear. I didn't write a date on the paper and I was like so mad, but like legit. I wrote like just the main line. I wrote, this is real. This is me. This is, I think I wrote like, this is who, where I'm supposed to be. Like I wrote something almost identical to her chorus before the song came out. So I'm just like realizing this now. Maybe I was channeling back then and I didn't even know it, man. But that is weird. And I wrote in a whole song. I actually used to try and write songs when I was little. So, cause I was more into music back then. So um, yeah, I wrote an entire song, but it was like, that was the chorus for my song. And I was like, she stole my lyrics. <laughs> Yeah, so anyways, weird message, but yeah, thought I would point that out. I keep hearing caric caricatures, caricatures, something about like cartoonist characters. Oh my god, yeah, this is coming out again. Miss Honey. I keep hearing something about Moby Dick or what's his name? Um, an author? I don't know, anyways. Um, I get something about this like... I don't know. This is so weird. This card, every time, it's reminding me of my friend. I don't know why. She reminds me of my one friend. And she's a Cancer, so that's why I said you could be a Cancer. Because I already was thinking about that earlier. And then this card came out, and I'm like, wow. Yeah, definitely. It's very strange. Something about the chocolates, too. Do you remember, like, the very specific chocolates? Very specific chocolate cake? That could be something related here. Also makes me think of, again, someone who has, like, ability wow that's so weird i just talked about channeling when i was younger and then we're talking about matilda here and the high priestess just like someone could be talking about maybe you've always been like kind of strange or kind not been in a bad way though like i see like different even someone's describing you as a child like going back to when you're younger like I don't know I feel like maybe there's like something that you didn't even realize maybe like me like you didn't realize till now about the way you grew up and like how it affected you today or like you were just like a child that was like kind of different or you did things in a different way um maybe you didn't have like as many friends or something I don't know why I'm just getting this like energy of that but like you're gonna like meet your people or like I don't know it's like you're always destined to like do something different I'm not sure, guys. Or maybe something about a teacher. This makes me think of a teacher as well, right? Maybe a teacher had a significant role in your life. Someone was really pivotal in your childhood or something. Something about the way you grew up. Maybe it's also talking about, it could be talking about someone's mother. Someone could be talking to someone's mother, you know? Maybe being like, wow, like, I understand now, like, why this person is the way they are. Or, like, <laughs> learning more about you. Like, talking about, yeah, I get, like, mother and child, like, talking about how you guys grew up together, whatever, or how you were when you were a kid. Yeah, I'm hearing something about how you were, like, as a baby, someone describing this. Okay, I don't know, guys, this reading is getting so almost, like, personal. This is weird. 
this picture, I know this is like Mariah Carey or something, right? Like, it looks like so much like my mom when she was younger. Like my mom's hair looks exactly like that. I'm just talking about a mom here. Like this looks just like my mom when she was younger, at least to me, like the, the same hair. My mom was like super, super pretty, like when she was younger. I'm not saying I got any of that. I look more like my dad to be honest, but my mom was like, literally like, yeah. Everyone always used to juggle, be like, how did your dad get your mom? Like, I don't understand. <laughs> but yeah, she was, uh, looked just like that. So that was definitely a message. That was weird. And then, oh my God, guys, did I not say I saw Aladdin's carpet? Look at, this reading is so strange. Um. Yeah, there you go, right there. Carpet, talking about, um, I don't know. I don't know why I'm also getting like rug burn or something. It reminds me again of childhood. Something about like falling down the stairs or like tripping on the carpet or like, you know, fighting with your siblings. <laughs> I don't know why this is coming through. Um, I feel like maybe it's always something too that maybe your family had hoped for you or like your friends. Like I see someone having like your best interests at heart, like wanting the best for you. Like they do want you to be happy. I mean, I'm hearing like, how did you meet or something? Something about internet connection or just connection in general. I was getting something the other day about MSN, like, you know, like old messenger chat back in my day <laughs> something about that the internet connection thing has been coming out so much lately like i keep hearing something about the internet i also was hearing um the power outage was like more than we expected or something something about a large widespread outage which actually a channel is not far back reading so i don't know if that's going to be significant in the future at all could be related to a storm um well no duh but like i was getting something about a, a particular storm that could happen like when you guys are reuniting <laughs> Um, that could be important. I'm hearing, um, all the colors of the rainbow, the, what is that? I was about to say Mulan, um, Pocahontas song. Okay, that was really random. I just heard crystal meth. I don't know what that's about. I'm hearing published author, Croatia, neatly disposed of. I keep hearing Puss in Boots as well. Something about boots is significant. Someone's boots. Someone could have a cat. Um, something about a cake. I'm hearing croaking, like frogs. I feel like someone feels this is like magical. Like this reunion coming back together. Even someone's family or friends. <clears throat> I feel like they... they um, don't know how this is happening. Like, they feel like this feels unreal. Um, something about they feel like... Like, um... They weren't expecting maybe even you to rewrite about something or this to actually happen. Um, I see, like, someone's friend, too. Almost, like, also biting their lip. Like, they want to say something so bad. Like, someone's friends are so excited. Or someone's mother or someone's family. Like, they really want to say something. But I see them trying to keep a secret. But I just get there's, like, <laughs> one person here who's, like, Oh, my God, I just want to say something. And everyone's, like, no. <laughs> something like that. Like, someone's excited. Maybe it's even just this person. I do get someone really likes your lips, by the way. That's, like, definitely been coming through. Oh, my God. I can't with these cards. I mean, okay, to be fair, these cards are 90s decks. So this is essentially my childhood anyways. But the fact that I also intuitively chose this deck today means something. Everything has meaning, right? So I will always remember that. But I collected these books when I was little, too. That was, like, my thing. So that's funny. That's coming out. It makes me think of also like fear though, someone being nervous to do something. It looks like a barbecue in this card too, something outdoors maybe. I don't know if you guys remember these things too, I remember those. Um, yeah, it's like this was um, a fantasy. Like someone didn't think this would actually come become reality. It's like magical when this happens. It feels almost unreal. Like, I get something about sparking inspiration, like, for other people. Or it just, like, inspires other people. Like, your type of love that you guys have. Your type of connection. Like, it's something, like, I feel like, again, like, you would only see in movies. Like, I just keep hearing something about a movie. Um, 
I keep getting a particular song too from a specific movie. I don't know. It's just like, it's very romantic. I see someone just like, yeah, it's like a movie scene. I just keep getting that. Like it's almost unbelievable or something. Also, wow. Wow, guys, the synchronicities lately. Look at this card. Does that not look like Mater, like I was just talking about? Like something about a pickup truck or something? I was getting that. Oh my god, wait. <gasps> Whoa, okay, my mind is blown right now. I can't even make this up, guys. Look, this. I was seeing that. I was just seeing that this morning. I was seeing a vision of it when I was meditating. I was like, I don't know what that is. It looks like, I was thinking it looked kind of like a water tower or something. Or like, I was thinking again, like a large like windmill or something like that. But I was seeing this part right here. <sighs> so weird. Something about that. I don't know what that is. Like climbing up somewhere. Someone does something in construction. I keep hearing scaffolding. Or they're building something. Windshield wipers. I keep seeing the windshield wipers going back and forth like it's raining. Maybe it's referring to like it's really windy out, very stormy or something on a farm. Stormy day. I don't know. I don't know why, but stormy. Stormy. I don't even know the Kardashians at all. Literally, I pay no attention to them, but my friends say, and that's the only thing it's making me think of right now. I don't really think they're like bad or anything. I just, I don't really watch them. Um, okay, we're gonna pull a couple, like, letter charms, because apparently we're just doing, like, year-long readings now. I hope you guys don't mind that. Um, it's just easier for me than uploading, like, a bunch of videos, because I hate editing. <laughs> I'd rather just never edit anything. That would be great. Um, but then my videos sometimes be even more boring and long. <laughs> Alright, by the way, I also was hearing, um, martini glass randomly earlier today as well. And something about completely wasting my time. One second, okay. I guess I should ask you a question. Um, what does be, what, you know, what is coming up for this reunion? Like, describe more about the reunion of Divine Masculine and Divine Feminine. Because I feel like that's what everyone wants to know, right? We got G. I'm hearing Channing Tatum again. I keep hearing that. Or Chatham. Chatham Kent. We spell Jen. Gen Z, I'm hearing. Gender. Gender neutrality, I'm hearing. Jen. Maybe someone's name is Jen. Jennifer. Jenny. Gen C. That's weird. Gen C. <laughs> um. <clears throat> GNC, supplement, something about nutrition, diet, phone book I'm hearing, Jen, can, Canada, a can of something, a can of soda, vending machine again coming through, something about an arcade, next gen I'm hearing, next gen, next generation, generational karma, something about breaking generational ties, I'm hearing, can he do it? Yes, he can. Bob the Builder. Da, na, na. Yeah, something about building something, construction again. I'm hearing halal, halal right now. Um, Cancun. I'm also hearing Mexico. Candy store. I'm hearing take me to the candy shop. Candy canes. Candy cane lane. Again, coming through. Something about candy canes, like lining a road. I don't know why I keep seeing that. Cannon. I'm hearing cannonball. Something about ocean, beach, pool. Um, Lane, Lane, well, we just did Kane, so Kane, Lane, um, Lan, that makes me think of what I was hearing about the internet, I was hearing W-L-A-N, Lan port, I don't even know really what that is, but I'm hearing that, um, also don't mind me if I'm, like, really slow today at figuring these out, I'm, like, super tired, <laughs> um, Something about age as well could be significant here. We did talk about an age difference, like when we were talking about that court case situation. Age, um, cage as well. Someone could have felt caged in. Something about a chicken coop I keep getting or like something, an animal in a cage. A zoo. Oh yeah, I was getting something about, yeah, like zoo, lion, zebra. 
Um, I went back to one of my really old readings, uh, channelings. What am I saying? Yeah, channel messages. By the way, I would start reading them all now. Like, if you are in members, like, I would just go back to any of the older videos and listen to them again because, wow, there was so much in that. I was like, holy, so strange. Um, I had Barnes & Noble, actually, in one of my really old ones, and I was channeling that again lately. Um, and then stuff about the cruise ship, I already had channeled that. I also had stuff about... Um, what was it? Like, yeah, elephant, rhino, something about a zebra and a bear. I don't know. Just, like, random animals were coming out. Anyways, um, LG, something about LG appliances. I've been getting stuff like that, like Bosch, dishwasher, LG. Maybe someone's, like, moving in. I'm hearing renting, buying, something about new contract, new building. See, Chan, what is with that? Maybe someone's, like, is that, like, Chinese? I don't know. Chan, Channing Tatum, what is with that? It keeps coming out. Channel? Oh my god, look. <gasps> we spelled channel. Someone's a channel? Maybe you guys channel too. Something about channeling messages. Maybe a really important time to, yeah, definitely listen to what you're channeling or pay attention to synchronicities. I really get that right now. Like, there's a major crazy stuff going on with synchronicities at the moment. I'm also getting, like, something about Neil. Like, I know that's not always how you spell it, but, like, Neil kneeling down. I'm also hearing Navy SEAL, something about being in the Army. I'm hearing deported, something about migration, immigration. Something going on with that, definitely. I don't know. You may be in the past. That's weird. Something about Gale Force winds again, I'm hearing. That came through before. Gale. <sighs> I'm sure there's many more words. Ail. Ailment, sickness. I don't know. Ginger ale makes me think of. That makes me think of my grandparents. <laughs> so it was like the only place we had ginger ale all the time when I was little. Um, what else? What else? I don't know. Hail. It's like a street name that I know of. Um, eel. I know it's not how you spell it, but eel. Um, eager. I'm also hearing someone's eager to do something. Heal heal some healing from something as well heal i feel like you guys are gonna be in a very healing connection like very um i'm hearing reviving as well i don't know um lean we also have lean which i think i think came through before as well i kept hearing that song lean on me when you're not strong i'll be your friends i'll help you carry on except for i want to be more than your friend <laughs> it's what i keep getting i'm hearing ghana right now something about ghana um <clears throat> Canal, channel, canal. I know that's not how, again how you spell it, but something about canal, um, river. Mm, I don't know if there's anything else. I'm hearing name, heel. We already spelled that. Something about the heel of a boot shoe. I'm hearing boot scoot and buggy. Okay, should we pull anything else? Let's just see what comes out. Let me know if you guys find more. Something about maybe North Carolina. Um, I don't know. There's more. LA, Georgia. I don't know. Is that Georgia? <laughs> okay. There's a lot of O's. I'm hearing vote. Vows. And again, don't really worry about spelling. <laughs> eel. We actually did spell eel. Something about electric shock again coming through. That's been coming through for a while. I keep hearing that song, Electric Love. Uh, something about lightning and keeps coming out that, that day I'm hearing. That day. Lightning, thunder, that makes me think of the movie Cars. Um, I'm hearing screech. Screeching to a halt, screeching stop. I don't know why. Last night, um, I have a train tracks that are kind of near my house, and I was hearing them. They were, like, really loud the other day. They're not usually loud, but they were, like, honking, whatever it's called, pulling, <laughs> making the loud noise, like, a lot. So I don't know if that's, like, a message. Something about screeching to a halt it makes me think of train tracks again. In that movie spider-man um anyways um neil armstrong i'm hearing something about space that keeps coming out avon isn't that like a company is that face products it makes me think of arbon too avon avion something about birds vaughn isn't that in toronto veal Something about, that makes me think of farming, cows, Italian food as well. Whole, we spell whole, whole in the ground. 
like I've been talking about, honing in on something. Lane, Lay, Lav, Lav, Love. Wow, literally we spelled love. That took me a while to get that one. Lone, again. We spelled lone multiple times now. Um, we also was spelling like leave, something about leaving someone. Leave on, I'm hearing leaving on the lights. Go on, go on, just do it. I'm hearing get her done. <laughs> Um, yeah, I was hearing hasta la vista, baby, as well, in terms of leave. <laughs> That's something that I say to myself, though, too, so I'm like, maybe that's just me. Um, I'm hearing, yeah, honey, as well. BS, something is BS. Um, oh my god, that's my initials, actually. <laughs> I just realized, well, they were just backwards, but yeah, those are my initials, so, um, that's fun. We also spell SOB as well. <laughs> sobbing some sobbing crying something's very emotional been we it's been too long it's been so long since we've been together so being so so let it be let it be i'm hearing again that same song the beatles something about the crosswalk um also something about someone who i'm getting this message of like okay this is kind of random some son um like Something about someone who is like been denied or like something didn't work out. I keep seeing because I've seen videos on this lately too. Um, it's supposed to be a message for myself, not gonna lie, but like something about you know, if you've had like something that you started that failed, um, I just keep getting like it's kind of like it wasn't your time yet because I keep hearing it's your time. Like, I don't know why that's coming through lately. So, like, maybe it wasn't your time then. Maybe something failed for a reason is what I keep hearing. It doesn't have to be in a love situation. I'm seeing this more as, like, career-wise. Something didn't work out. But if you look at all the people that are successful, they're, like, bazillion times they've tried. Like, they were talking about, um, what is that? I'm here in Brussels right now, but something about Dyson, the vacuum. Apparently, he created, like, I don't even know how many, like, 100 or something vacuums or 50 i don't know something some big number before he even got one that worked you know like the beatles were denied like they were told they would never make it in the music industry like there's so many people and jeff bezos i think he like went was it like almost bankrupt or something at first and like i don't know everyone like it's almost like to be successful you have to fail first it's like the failing is what makes you knowledgeable enough to eventually be successful because you learn from each time you fail and the more you fail the more you learn right so it's almost like that's a huge message here i get like it's kind of like don't worry about the failures because they're just leading you to success you know like eventually you're gonna you're gonna get there like you're gonna get the right one one time and it's it's gonna be the big one i don't know why i'm hearing something about jackpot maybe someone wins the lottery i'm not sure but that's just kind of what i get all right so something about leaves fall maybe one i don't know guys i know there's definitely more but I just don't feel like trying to figure it out tonight, Bones. Um, I'm hearing that again. I feel it in my bones. Oh, 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 oh. I don't know who sings that. Is that One Republic? I don't know. That's a song, though. Um, yeah, I've actually been channeling that, though. I feel it in my bones. That's what I kept hearing. So if someone knows this deep down, they know something here. They know it's supposed to happen. They know what they're meant for it. By the way, spelling hen. I was just talking about chicken coop. Something about chicken eggs. Um, I'm hearing what came first, the chicken or the egg. Something about like deep theories of life. Maybe you guys talk about uh, something about a van. Phone. I'm hearing. I'm also hearing go home. Something about et phone home. Anyways. Okay, I don't know. You guys can, like, figure it out from here. I'll just, like, leave these up. You can screenshot them if you want, and feel free to comment any more words you have, because I know there's more. I just, I don't have the patience right now to figure them all out. I'm really ready for bed. I'm also hearing lean. Okay, we're gonna stop. Okay, all right. So, thank you guys so much for watching. Please comment, like, and subscribe if you enjoyed this video. Um, let me know. Tell me if anything resonates. Uh, also, keep me posted if anything exciting happens in your life. I love hearing the comments. Thank you to everyone, by the way, who's ordered 
readings on my Etsy shop too. You guys are great for all the nice comments and reviews. I really, really, really appreciate that. Um, for anyone who's recently ordered two, I am getting through your readings. I did message one person just because I was a bit confused by your um, question. So I'm just waiting on a reply and then I will do your reading. And then um, also, yeah, I have one other person who I'm doing their readings tomorrow. So, but yeah, we've been relatively consistent with that. So it's been good, actually. I really like doing it on Etsy. So yeah, if you're interested in a reading, that is where they are now. It's the only place I'm going to be doing them from now on just because it keeps me organized so yes very much appreciate that also really appreciate the people that purchased my decks as well it means a lot i am about to release another one eventually soon which happens to be a purple deck because apparently purple is the color right now i didn't even plan that but it is so anyways thanks for watching guys again comment like and subscribe probably already said that like 500 times but yeah feel free to do that uh feel free to join members if you want more random messages from me and uh, yeah, I appreciate you and I will see you all in my next video. All right, goodbye. <laughs>